William and Kate broke up a few years before they wed, Kate went on a short holiday to relieve sadness. Kate Middleton and Prince William are one of the most talked about couples in the world, from their happy family life with Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, to their relatable day-to-day -day habits at Kensington Palace, they're just like us really. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are currently celebrating their tenth year of married life and they seem so happy in fact it's hard to remember that there were ever rocky patches. Prince William and Catherine's fairy tale wedding in 2011 was an event that will go down in history. The couple tied the knot at Westminster Abbey in front of record crowds and a television audience which rivaled the likes of the Olympics and the World Cup. While it may seem like the couple have been together the whole time since they met back in 2001, that is just not the case. The future Duke and Duchess of Cambridge broke up a few years before they wed and, to get over the separation, traveled to a surprising location. It has been 20 years since the famous royal couple first met at St Andrews University in Scotland and their decade-long marriage appears to be perfect. Once they both graduated in 2005, Catherine took a job as an accessories buyer at Jigsaw, while Prince William followed in his family's footsteps and joined the military. Unfortunately by 2007 their loved-up relationship was said to be on the rocks. It was revealed at the time that the couple briefly called quits on their romance during a phone call that Kate took while she was at work. One of her former colleagues told the Mirror in April 2007 that they saw Kate take the call in the office car park in London. The source said, it was clear it was William, and definitely a tiff. Around the middle of the day, she was pacing the car park outside the office on her mobile. A few people noticed because it's a pretty unusual thing to do. She'd deliberately gone outside to take the call because she didn't want to be overheard. Kate was walking up and down and looking upset as if she was having an argument. But she didn't cry. Word went round that it was William and they were having problems. Now it's clear what it was all about. When she came back to the office she didn't say a thing and disappeared for the rest of the day. It was later revealed that in the wake of their breakup, Catherine went on a short break to Dublin with her mother and a close circle of friends. The breakup was only temporary and they quickly reunited. But they did make a reference to their famous separation in their 2010 engagement interview. We were both very young. Prince William explained of the split in their 2010 engagement video interview. It was at university, we were sort of both finding ourselves as such and being different characters and stuff, it was very much trying to find our own way and we were growing up. He continued, it was just sort of a bit of space and a bit of things like that, and it worked out for the better. Kate added, and I think I at the time wasn't very happy about it, but actually it made me a stronger person, you find out things about yourself that maybe you hadn't realized, or I think you can get quite consumed by a relationship when you are younger, and I really valued that time for me as well although I didn't think it at the time. Looking back on it, their reconciliation is all but confirmed when Kate attends the concert for Diana at Wembley Stadium, organized by William and Harry to mark the 10th anniversary of their mother's death. Though she wasn't seated with the princes, it seemed to be a sign the couple was back together. After a royal engagement comes a royal wedding, of course. The marriage of Catherine Elizabeth Middleton and Prince William Arthur Philip Louis takes place on Friday, April 29, 2011, and is an official bank holiday in the UK, as William is the heir to the throne. The ceremony at Westminster Abbey is broadcast around the world, with the British royal family, various other royals from around the world, and celebrities like Sir Elton John, David, and Victoria Beckham, Guy Ritchie, and Joss Stone in attendance. Middleton looks stunning in her Alexander McQueen lace gown, designed by Sarah Burton, and her sister, Pippa Middleton, also makes headlines for her own gorgeous white dress.
do. She'd deliberately gone outside to take the call because she didn't want to be overheard. Kate was walking up and down and looking upset as if she was having an argument. But she didn't cry. Word went round that it was William and they were having problems. Now it's clear what it was all about. When she came back to the office she didn't say a thing and disappeared for the rest of the day. It was later revealed that in the wake of their breakup, Catherine went on a short break to Dublin with her mother and a close circle of friends. The breakup was only temporary and they quickly reunited. But they did make a reference to their famous separation in their 2010 engagement interview. We were both very young, Prince William explained of the split in their 2010 engagement video interview. It was at university, we were sort of both finding ourselves as such and being different characters and stuff, it was very much trying to find our own way and we were growing up. He continued, it was just